Hey everybody, so this is going to be December's Ipsy bag unboxing and it's now January so I'm super late on this but I moved and mail with moving can get a little bit ridiculous and it's been coming super late in the month as it is so I only got it like a couple days ago so I thought I'd share with you guys anyways. Um, yeah, so when you open it up there's a the little card inside and then this is what this month's bag looks like for December with a little heart with Ipsy on it. I'll leave the link down below. I'm sure you guys, most of you have been watching these videos anyways, but if you don't know what Ipsy is, I'll leave the link down below. $10 a month subscription, free shipping in the United States, and yeah, you usually get four or five beauty products, and I've been doing it for over a year, well over a year, and I've been really happy with it most months anyways. So yeah, when you open it up, there's the products inside. The first one I got was the NYX Butter Lip Balm in Marshmallow, and I haven't actually tried any of the NYX Butter Lip Balms. I, I have the lip glosses, the butter lip glosses, but not the lip balms. Um, I have actually tried this out, and to tell you the truth, I was not impressed. It, the color it looks like it's gonna be promising, like a very neutral nude color. And it looks pretty on your hand, almost peachy. But I don't know, on my lips it like skipped a bit and it was patchy. I didn't find it all that moisturizing, to be honest. Um, I don't know. Just, it was a bit chalky, if that makes sense, for a lip balm. So, I don't know, I'll keep trying it out, but I wasn't super impressed the couple times that I did use it. Okay, the next product is from Kaylin. This is the Just Mineral Eye Polish in number five Orchid. I haven't actually swatched this yet, but it looks like a powder eyeshadow. So let's see what that looks like comes on a sponge, which is nice because it's not super messy. Ooh, it's quite pretty actually. It's like a champagne gold. Can't tell you how many different versions of champagne gold eyeshadow I own, but uh, I guess that means I really like it, so I will give it a try. I thought the powder would kind of, you know, poof everywhere, but it didn't. It's sticking to my hand good, so that's nice. The next thing I see is from BWC Beauty Without Cruelty Premium Aromatherapy Facial Cleanser, 100% vegan. That's what that looks like. Um, I mean, I like the brand, so that's exciting, but it's a facial cleanser, so that's nothing too, too exciting for me. I'm traveling next week, so it's maybe something I could bring along or just put in my shower, but it's kind of a whatever product. The next one is the Sexy Hair Style Sexy Hair 450 Degree Blowout, 7 Shine, 1 Hold. So this is a heat defense blowout spray. There's a whole bunch of other things on there too. Heat defense blowout spray. So I guess you put this on before you blow dry your hair and it protects your hair and then I guess it helps make it shiny and hold. I don't know. I like that this brand is hit, hit or miss for me, so I'm definitely going to try it out. Um, and then the last product is from Tarte, which is, which is exciting. It's the Lights, Camera, Lashes Travel Size Mascara. I believe I've tried this out before. I'm going to open the wand so I can remember what it looks like. Oh, I don't know. It's hard to say. Just a very basic wand, bristle brush wand. So I will give that a go uh, once I don't have lash extensions on anymore because I haven't worn mascara in about a month now. I'm about to get these lashes redone again for my sister's wedding and then I'm undecided if I'm going to keep up with it or not. Um, and a bunch of you wanted to know some more information about my lash extensions. I know this is totally off topic but I do plan to do a video on it hopefully after I get them redone again so you can see them kind of in full force but I love them and so once I don't have those anymore I will try out this mascara and that's it that's this one's bag so mascara facial cleanser eyeshadow lip balm and hair blowout spray so not too bad not one of the most exciting months but not a terrible month either let me know what you guys got in your December ipsy bag down below and I hope you're all doing well and thank you so much for watching bye